Okay, guys, so I have done the uh, last three questions in the C4 paper. Uh, so question four, part A. So area R is the integral from 0 to 1 of 2 or 1 plus 3 x to the half dx. So all I did in the second step is just took the 2 out and then put the fraction at the top. So it's minus half power. And when you integrate it, you get 4 thirds 1 plus 3x to the half zero to, uh, between 0 and 1. And then you substitute the values. You get 4 over 3 units squared. That's the answer. And now for the volume, as you know, the formula is V equals integral from A to B pi y squared dx. So you put the function in, and as you see, so when you square the 2, it goes as 4 pi outside, and 1 plus 3x to the half squared is basically is 1 plus 3x to the minus 1 when you bring it to the top, and then you integrate it, and you get 4 pi over 3 ln 4 unit cubes. Okay. Question 5. This is the rate of change question. So volume equals 4 third pi r cubed, so dv dr equals 4 pi r squared. dv dt is 500 over 40 plus 1 squared, that's given in the question. So dr dt equals to dr dv times dv dt, which is a chain rule, and when you multiply it, you get 125 over pi r squared over, uh, basically 125 over pi r squared 40 plus 1 squared. So that's your dv dt, dr dt. Now, uh, to find the volume, so dv dt equals 500 over 40 plus 1 squared, so dv integral of dv equals integral of 540 plus 1 to the minus 2 dt. So the volume equals minus 125 over 40 plus 1 plus c. So you can see you're dividing by minus 4 because there's a power minus 1 and there's a 4 factor coming up from the bracket so that's what you get and we know that when t is equal to 0, v is equal to 0 so that gives you c equals to 125 so our equation is minus 125 over 40 plus 1 plus 125 so that's part c there is one more part uh, to work out those values let me just get that over so part d I, when t equals to 10, volume equals to minus 125 over 4 bracket 10 plus 1 plus 125. That gives you volume equals to 5,000 over 41 centimeter cubes. Now, if you plug that value into the v equals 4 thirds pi r cube equation, and if you simplify and cube root it, you get radius equals to 3.08 centimeters. Now, we need to find dr dt. We know dr dt is uh, 125 pi r squared, 40 plus 1 squared from before. So when t is equal to 10 and r is equal to 3.08, dr dt equals to 0 0.0025 centimeters per second. Okay. Now we go to the last question. Uh, it's quite long, but it's, it's not difficult. So we need to do partial fractions for this fraction. Uh, 2 over 2 minus x 1 plus x squared equals to a over 2 minus x plus b over 1 plus x plus c over 1 plus x squared. So we get 2 equals a 1 plus x squared plus b 2 minus x 1 plus x plus c 2 minus x. So when you solve it, you get c equals to 2 thirds, a equals to 2 ninths, and b is also equal to 2 ninths. So, so I've written it out here. So the partial fractions are 2 over 9 2 minus x plus 2 over 9 1 plus x plus 2 over 3 1 plus x squared. Now what I did, I individually uh, did the binomial expansion for each fraction. So for the 2 ninths, uh, 2 over 9 2 minus x, which is the same as 2 over 9 2 minus x to the minus 1, when you expand that you get 4 over 9 plus 2x over 9 plus x squared over 9 plus dot dot dot. So I mean I'm not going to go to binomial expansion guys, you should know how to do that. Okay, it's just simple fractions uh, and just simplifying it. Now for the second fraction, similar kind of story, you just expand it, so it'd be 2 nines, 1 plus x to the minus 1, when you expand it, you get 2 nines minus 2 nines x plus 2 nines x squared. And for the third one, it's the same thing, so 2, two over 3, 1 plus x to the minus 2, you expand it and you get 2 over 3 minus 4 over 3x plus 2x squared. Okay, so now the entire fraction equals to the sum of all those expansions. You can see some of these cancel, and your answer is 4 over 3 minus 4 over 3x plus 7 over 3x squared. You can take the third out if you want, so that leaves you with 4 minus 4x plus 7x squared uh, plus dot dot dot. Okay, guys, those are the solutions, and good luck for tomorrow.